Hello everyone, welcome to another video here on the Fox Tech YouTube channel. This time we talk about the iPhone, more specifically how you can increase the ringer volume inside of your uh, iPhone, of course. So we of course need to make sure that it's fired up like this. So we have the iPhone going on right now. And in case you want to increase the ringer volume, all you have to do is open up the settings like this and make sure to scroll up or down to find the sounds and haptics. So when you go inside of in here, inside of the sounds and haptics, you're going to be able to see the slider for ringtone and alert volume. Ringtone and alert is basically the ringer. So you can slide it up and down like we want and it's going to give you like a representation it's going to give you a sample or what it's going to sound like so you need to make sure that this is something you want to keep it that way either slide it all the way to the right or keep it however you want an interesting option is change with buttons when you enable the change with buttons after that when you come back to the home screen you're going to be able to use the buttons the actual volume sliders on your iphone to increase the ringer volume right from the home screen i personally don't like to keep it turned on because i want to use my buttons to change the volume of my content not the volume of my ringer. So that's something I like to keep turned off, but it's up to you to decide how you want to use it. Of course, the next thing which you should pay attention to is the focus mode, because if I go to the control center, you can see there is the option to go to the focus mode. And in case you are in any of these, in case you are in the work mode or uh, do not disturb, whatever it is in your case, and this basically means that it could theoretically block or the decrease or completely ignore the phone calls on your iPhone. So you need to go to the settings and go to the focus mode and play around with these settings. Make sure that you decide to check out the work section, see which people can call you if you don't have any blocks on the apps. You can see you can silence notifications from, for example, the phone, whatever. Make sure that you, that you have it set up properly. And for example, make sure that you don't even have it scheduled because you may not even have it enabled and you can just turn it on on its own. So this is another thing which could prevent it. And the next thing is, of course, the physical damage because it can happen that the speakers inside of your iPhone could be basically broken and there could be dirt or something inside it which could decrease the volume of your ringtone. In this case, there's not much which you can do with it on your own. You're going to have to bring your iPhone to a some kind of service or at the Apple store. It depends. But before we, we wrap up this video, I need to show you this platform, which is the Fox Tech educational platform. There you're going to find in-depth guides on all of the apps on your iPhone. You're going to be able to watch a video editing course, all of that for free. The link to join is down below in the description. Make sure to join it for free and you're going to find all the things which I talk about right now. Anyways, I'm going to wrap up this video. If you found it useful, make sure to leave a thumbs up, but definitely subscribe down below so you never miss future videos and tutorials like this one. Thanks a lot for watching. See you guys later.